What's going on today guys? So today I've got a lot of little bit of running around to do. I have been super slacking on, I'm gonna hold these tight so I don't quit flinging keys around. But I've been super busy and haven't had really a whole lot of time to actually do any stuff with the vlog lately. So today we're gonna try and film some stuff. I might do multiple days worth of stuff today. It's actually became a nice day. It was super bad thunderstorm lightning outside earlier today. But we're gonna run to the store, get some stuff done. Um, and then hopefully come back and do some stuff with my car so I can actually have some decent footage to upload here soon. So let's get started. I'm actually taking my wife's car today just because she needs gas really bad. But yeah, and I'm also filming on my phone because I don't feel like carrying around my camera. So we are taking my wife's car today to Home Depot because she needs gas really bad. So we're going to do that for her. Uh, maybe I should actually clean up the car. It's an actual. She doesn't. She doesn't wash it very often. So maybe we'll do that too today while we're out. She is currently working on the bathroom, trying to get that all done. Um, as most of maybe some of you guys know, we're working on our bathroom, trying to get it finished. The depot is super busy today. Bunch of people must be out just getting stuff done for the house. But yeah, today we just need to pick up a few little things to get some stuff done around the house. We definitely need to do some landscaping here soon, so we will be doing that very soon, which is highly upsetting because I hate doing yard work. It is super humid out today. Holy shit. So we just got done at Home Depot. We're gonna go fill up her car. This video is gonna be a little bit different than my other videos because this one's more of like an update video of what's been going on in my life since my last upload, which has only been like three weeks, but still. When the lights are out, my heart is your own. When the stars are crashing, your heart is my own. Exciting experience every time you find it. Connect with us on Facebook and Twitter. At the gas station. <laughs> what is life? So I had to stop at the store whenever I got gas. This is supposedly... Don't mind the other shitty beers that are in my fridge. I need to make a beer run. Anyway, I saw this. Which is rated one of the best beers in Ohio. So I had to give it a try. It's a pretty good damn IPA. So it's the Columbus Brewing Company. I don't know how to pronounce that. The Bodhi? It's a double IPA. So yeah, really good. Definitely if you're in Columbus area, give this one to try. It's been hard to find, I will say that. So definitely a thumbs up. So as I said before, this vlog is gonna be a little bit different. I actually planned on recording for Easter, having a vlog uploaded. We're gonna go drift triking. So that vlog's actually gonna start now. Hopefully you guys had a great Easter weekend. Tomorrow is actually Easter for me, so you'll be seeing this video after it comes out. But we're back in West Virginia again. I didn't get to do everything I wanted to last time I was in, and it's been a little while since I've done a video, so I thought, that bird is really annoying. I thought, what better way to kind of spend Easter than with family? And so we're gonna go out and go drifting with my cousin. We didn't get to get drift last time, so we're gonna go out and do with the drift trikes this time. We're gonna be going playing around on the Razor as well, so that'll be a good time. And so I totally didn't mention this, but I end up going and getting a tattoo. I just decided I was going to go out and get the Deathway Hallows tattooed, so I'm team tatted. Eventually, I plan on doing my whole arm. I'm so white right now, it's not even funny. 
but I plan on doing my whole arm. I'm gonna do like a whole family related, not really a whole sleeve. I'm gonna kind of and kind of stop it at where the Deathly Hallows is, kind of be my cutoff. But yeah, I'm tattoo crazy now, I guess. So yeah, but we're gonna go out and dip drift and let's go. All right, so we just got out to the farm and took the razor out here. So give you if I can get out of this thing. There we go. Quick little tour of where we're at. <clears throat> All right, so this is where basically I grew up, spent a lot of my time. This is, this was my grandparents' farm. They passed away a few years ago, but yeah. We used to race lambs down here. My sister still shows uh, steers for 4-H, so that's where she keeps her steer at. There she is. I haven't been on this thing in a minute. But yeah, she's a little dirty. She's been beaten up. I remember the brake is broken. All right, so here they are, both of them here. The orange one is my cousin's, the pink one is mine. I was super big into breast cancer awareness when I was younger, so when I built my trike and when my uncle helped me build my trike, that's kind of what we went with. Um, mine is built from the front end of a BMX bike, a GT, and then the rest is just old, a bunch of metal that we picked up at stores, tractor tires on the back. Not actually sure how long these tires will actually last today because it feels like the bearings already going bad out of them. So we might end up just using one drift trike today. And then my front forks are actually from a green machine. So we chopped it, welded it to the original bike frame there. And so now I have working pedals so I can pedal. But at the same time, when you quit pedaling, you can actually ride the bike and it won't like to be smacking you. So my cousin Ty, he went a different approach. He went with a smaller bmx bike i want to say his is a 16 inch where mine's a 20 inch but his 16 inch it's got a lot more angle as you see than what mine does but also a lot smaller of a tire he also went with just the pegs which can be nice i definitely like it but i'm definitely a big fan of my pedals um also just running tractor tires and these are actual the pvc pipes that we've cut on the back fit the tire in way over inflated the tires so that way they don't come flying off and yeah that's basically a drift trike for you. It's super easy as long as you can weld. They're weld and cut. They're super simple to make. I'm just gonna sit here and wait for Ty to show up and uh, yeah, whenever he gets here, we'll start drifting. can see there is definitely nowhere near enough content to actually have one full video just based on drift triking and my tattoo I was hoping to videotape a lot more and do a little bit more stuff but just didn't have enough time and I just didn't feel like drift doing all that stuff it was Easter I want to spend time with family it was a good time so this video is going to kind of fill in the gaps of where I've been for the last three weeks so hopefully you guys enjoy if you do like this video make sure you hit the like button below and if you want to keep seeing awesome content make sure you hit the subscribe button and uh, we'll catch you next time thanks guys